All right, here we go. What's going on, everyone? I am Paul Bissonnette, a.k.a. Biz Nasty of the Spit and Chicklets podcast. I know this is not being filmed on a TikTok, so I may have already lost your attention. But for those of you who are still around, um, I guess we'll start off with how I got here. Um, my friend, Jeff Jacobson, got a message from uh, Premier John Horgan. And uh, when I got that news, I was like, oh, geez, what am I in trouble for? Some unpaid parking tickets downtown Vancouver. Maybe some illegal drone footage from my Biz Nasty Does BC documentary. But no, it was positive. It was to come talk to these next wave of graduates who are graduating in a, in a very unique time. Um, I guess that would be another opportunity to thank Dr. Bonnie Henry, who was also uh, a part of the board that asked me to speak here. So they may be regretting this at this point, but... Uh, uh, I don't really know what I'm supposed to do in these uh, graduation speeches, but I guess I will give one form of advice if that's what I'm supposed to do. Um, and by the way, this was Elias Pettison who was supposed to be here talking, but uh, they couldn't reach him. So they had to sub in some fourth line plug with a baked potato on his face to do this. So bear with me. Um, my one piece of advice, and, and I mean, given what's, what's going on in the world right now, is um, moving forward, you know, you, you guys are definitely going to face some adversities, especially when trying to accomplish big things in life. And, you know, instead of maybe shying away from those things and not taking them head on, you know, I would encourage you to to embrace the chaos and, you know, use use that adversity in order to get stronger because eventually, you know, those things are going to carve out who you are as a human being. And, you know, if you're able to get through those things and on a continual basis, I think you're going to find out that that hard work in order to do so was was very much worthwhile in the end. So that's the only thing I got to say to you guys. Um, I got to thank you for inviting me. This is a huge honor for me. No, this is not my cap and gown. I stole it from my girlfriend who uh, is a lawyer. Um, it's not what you know. It's who you know, folks, okay? That's a lesson for another day, though. So thank you very much for having me. Thank you to everyone involved, and a happy graduation to all you 2020 graduates. Whew, I talk too much.